What's up, up you guys? guys? It's your girl Ava. It's your boy Jacquez. And together we are the, the Way family. family. So, you want to tell them what we're going to discuss today? You want to make a video about how we met? You want to make a video? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I got it. Come on. Well, you know, um, how we met was um, we both from Chris Domingo, you know, just chilling on there. And, uh, she liked my preacher, you know, I liked the hugs, you know. She said that she little guy, I was like, yeah, little guy too, you know. So I told her about DMing me, so she didn't do it. So I had to go back on the Christian music site to uh, test her. I'm like, hey, like, hit me up, you know. So she did, so we started talking, you know. It went from there. And the funny part is, I'm gonna leave that part in. We didn't meet on Christian Mingle. So we met technically on an app called Monkey. <laughs> Why are you smiling? You don't want to say that. You know on on Christian Sing I mean on Christian Because we did not meet on no dating app. <laughs> He said, he said Christian single. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't even know Christian single. Okay, we went, we met on um, a monkey sponsored by Christian Minkle. We'll say that. Yeah. And basically, for those who don't know, because normally we just tell people we met through social media, which we did. Monkey is basically an app where you can talk to girl or guys and just like meet new people, make friends. You just get on there and each person that you talk to runs about 15 seconds long. And unless you guys add time, like if you notice there's like something or you wanna keep talking to the person. Yeah, so that's what happened. And we added each other on Snapchat and he messaged me on Snapchat. <laughs> what did I say? He's like, hi, huh, you're a nice looking man. Really? That's what you get? Okay. I'm gonna put the screenshots of him messaging me first because he was like, hey, where are you from? And I was like, from heaven. And I'm like, so technically we started talking through Snapchat, but we met through Monkey. Mm. What made you Snapchat me? I think you were somewhere, you know. Yeah, nice dress on. You look really nice. That's all I said. Why do you want to keep talking to me? I mean, you seem like a nice person. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we met through social media. We started talking. We exchanged phone numbers. And we texted. Why don't you tell them? <laughs> why don't you tell them? Why are you laughing? Why don't you tell them how long it took between us texting to when we got on the phone? How long it took? Mm -hmm. She called me ASAP. No. How long did we text, Quiz? We text a little minute. He kept saying we were gonna get on FaceTime and then kept dodging us getting on FaceTime. And then it made me feel like, even though I seen his face on Monkey prior to Snapchat, but it was still kind of like sus. Like, why are we not FaceTiming? You know how it be when, like, you don't be on FaceTime with somebody like that. And, like, you gotta fill them out, like, you test them, like, you know? Yeah, but why wouldn't you fill them out through FaceTime? You can't even hear the tone and how you're texting. That don't matter. We test them. We fill each other out. No. He's, he <laughs> said. She wanna go on FaceTime, like, soon we get each other number, like. No, no, no. So you can smile at me. No, like, so. after a few days, it's like, why aren't we FaceTiming? Like, let's talk, like, face to face. You know why? Hmm. Lust. What? I ain't want you listing off me. You don't look, well, some people do, but it was a general face to face. So then what is monkey? There was no difference. Mike, see, I was on it with my cousin there. Like, we were sitting there like having fun. Exactly. Or all boys do. Yeah, and I was with my cousin on monkey. If we have face to face on monkey, we can have face to face on FaceTime and talk and make conversations. But I wasn't comfortable getting on FaceTime like that. Why? Cause like, I don't know. Oh, but not though. 
I don't know. He's just different. Like, I'm going to take it personally. You know, I'm going to FaceTime you. Like, maybe they... You told me... Maybe you, they didn't do that makeup. Then exactly, like, exactly. Like, then, like, if you I get on me, with you... You told me that you didn't... Wait, wait. If I get on with you and you're looking crazy, I'm going to be like, oh, no, nah, I can't talk Because, do you think I would have answered the phone looking crazy? I would have. I, I didn't. Let's just say this. One, he told me he didn't want to get on the phone at first. He told me this down the line. That he at first he didn't get on the phone because he was waiting to get a haircut. And I was okay, and that's fine. But you should just say that. And then and then he had on his little well not this one he had on a little chain every time he got on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I have my grandma chain, bro. <laughs> yeah, little <we're> cute chain. <laughs> no. Hey, you look cute, bro. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> you sounded like your dad laughing just now. He's like, ha. <laughs> I did. I'm not even going to front. The first at least month or two of FaceTime, because we FaceTime pretty often, but the first like few months, I was making sure I did my eyebrows at least every time I got on the phone. You want to tell me how you answer the phone? How did I answer the phone? You tell me, no. What do you mean how to answer the phone? <laughs> I didn't. We FaceTimed. No, you know we did get on the. Oh right. yeah, we did. Okay, yeah. I was at my cousin's house, and I went upstairs. And well, no, before we got on the phone, I told my cousin. I remember telling my cousin Haley that if we don't get on the phone within a week from now, I'm gonna stop talking to him because not even on no messed up stuff. It's just like. Then you messed what up. is so wrong you with getting on the nobody. phone? Then when but then, the phone. okay, but then at least instead of if you didn't want to do FaceTime, you could have been like, well, let's just regular call, which you end up doing because you didn't have a haircut. That's nice. That makes you feel like, oh, you want to look your best on FaceTime. Right. I get that. I always but, look my best. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, anyways, we end up getting on the phone. I told Haley this, and we end up getting on the phone. So at first, my mindset was like, let me see. Our, our conversation through text was really, you know, flowing, vibing, good. Like, we both shared that, like, we're in church. We both shared that we're, you know, just young, living our lives, trying to see, like, what's what. We were making jokes here and there, flirting a little bit. I went upstairs, and my, my mood changed about how I felt because I heard a man's voice on the phone. He has a southern accent, if you can't already tell. And I wasn't too fond of a, like talking to a guy with an accent. And when I was talking to him, I liked his accent. Okay. One thing that happened in the conversation, he got on the phone and he asked me what I had his number saved as. <laughs> I was like, oh, well, I didn't have his number saved because I felt like, you know, if we stop talking, his number wouldn't be on my phone. And if he texts me later down the line, it wouldn't be like, maybe so-and-so, you know how iPhone be doing. He was like, what's my number saved as? And I was like, what do you want it to be? And he was like, daddy. I was playing about that. <laughs> you weren't playing. We both started laughing when I said it. Yeah, we were laughing, but you wouldn't have, you would have felt on the high pedestal if I would have changed your name as Yeah, they would feel good if they get boo or something. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Get their name as daddy. Okay. My mom said to my daddy. <laughs> what? Golly. You just saying, like, she walking in the house, like, hey, daddy. Did she say that to you? <laughs> Hey, bro, like, I ain't like, she do say that, but, like, I don't know where she get that from. It's just a little loud be walking around my pimping. That's, um, it's honestly cute, though. And, like, she be like, hey, dad, I'm like, mom, why are you telling that, me? That's okay. I would say it. You can say it, but I'm not. Hmm, it, it depends. But I don't know. I don't know, it was just cute little banter when we first got on the phone. And I think we felt, we, well, we both felt, um, or how did you feel when you got off the phone? I felt I felt like like butterflies like uh like he he's really nice like he's cute like okay I'm like I'm gonna keep talking to him like I was glad that we got on the phone because I didn't want to stop talking to you but you know I know 
How did you feel when we first got the phone? Honestly. I was saying, like, butterfly. You know. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but no, no, I don't see it though. But like, I was like, oh, wait, no, she cool. You know, we didn't know each other. Yeah. Hey, you ain't too bad yet. You know? What do you mean it ain't too bad? Because, <laughs> like, I don't know. Cause when you phone somebody, like it can be like weird, yeah. real weird, and like it'll throw you off. Like, no, I don't want to talk to them. Yeah, it can make or break them. Yeah. Would you say that's part of the reason that you were scared to get on the phone, maybe? Yeah, cause like I don't like hurt people feeling though. Yeah. I read for my feeling be hurt than than yours. Yes and no. It's very hard to hurt my feeling though. Yeah, it is. It is. It is. Shout out to you, dear Wade. You know. Hard as a rock. But that's like a little quick story time. Nothing too long. Just to give you guys some more info about each other. Yeah. Know. But you know, that's all for the video. Comment, subscribe, like, you know. Thank you guys for tuning in. More videos to come. Thank you guys. Peace.